And what's going on, you bastards? And welcome back to another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan battle video where we are attempting the newest stage of Extreme Super Battle Road that would be Warriors of Universe 6 or Universe 6, whatever. Um, so our team, I think, is pretty straightforward and honestly... Probably the best team you could run besides physical Kefla, I guess. Like, maybe she could weave in there. But uh, you definitely want to use two hits. There's, uh, for the friends, there's, uh, you can either use uneasy aid strength or er, tech hit or strength Kefla, which that would be very bad. So our opening rotations, uh, I guess, kind of worked out. We had the double hit in which hit has a medium chance i believe of stunning the entire enemy rotation so he had two of them so he had two separate chances so it happened and we brought uh the tech khalifla tur and ssr because they will dodge everything besides the enemies in the last fight uh against beers and Whis, because technically they're not uh from the universal survival saga so you don't have a guaranteed chance of dodging them, which does make that uh, a little bit harder there. And then we also had this Strength Kale, which if she's on rotation with the Khalifla, she has Guard, which she still takes damage, don't get it wrong. But uh, she definitely takes it a lot better than most of the units here. Then we have LR, Kale, and Khalifla, who can still get bodied, but uh, can still whip out uh, some decent damage here. As you can see, you know, she's, uh, or they're pretty relentless with, uh, attacking and whatnot. So we only have 18 left. Uh, we made short work of, uh, this, this team. If you get the medium chance of stun, uh, everybody, and it was really good because with hit, hit does way more damage against already stunned enemies. Yeah, uh, if... What is it, like 60% or something? I don't know. He just has extra damage if the enemy's already stunned. So if you get his passive, like, right now, which I should have put hit in the first slot, and then the SSR Kale and then the, uh, or SSR Khalifa and the Kale, they link up slightly better. But, uh, yeah, the SSR really isn't here for damage, and neither, there, there's only really two and a half units here that are here for damage, and that's, uh, hit, and then, uh, you know, the hits... And then uh, Kale and Khalifa, which, uh, depending on how many additionals they get, uh, they can be uh, very damaging. So, you know, of course you want to match up, you know, with the typing, who you could do the most damage against. But also uh, with the hits, because hit is very susceptible to damage, unfortunately. Uh, you see that uh, physical Vegeta right there. I went for him. Because I know the Frieza can't do a whole lot against hit. Um, hit... If he goes type neutral on a super attack, even after he supers, takes over 600k damage, which is more than our entire health pool. So you have to be very careful. Well, all right, so we went for Goku, and then we went for Vegeta. Sorry. Uh, because there was a chance we would retarget and knock out Vegeta as well. Uh, if we additional super, you want to build hits... I want to say a good mix of crit and then additional because um, I, either one is honestly uh, really good. And we also have Int Vados. Vados is, uh, I built her full dodge. She is here to lower attack and seal. And she also supports. She does the support the best for this uh, team. She does what, like Universe 6, Bond of Master and Disciple, and... Uh, I forgot what other categories. She supports three categories, like 20%. And like, what, like one key each or something like that? Uh, so yeah, this team is pretty solid. We only have Frieza left. We're, we're making... We are getting fantastic RNG with the, uh, the stun all. And then hit, you know, getting some additionals here and there. Getting some nice dodges, you know, the clutch stuns and all that. It's, uh, this run worked out a lot as you can see i do have the auto map and battle already so i did this and i beat the event already 
But uh, I was just like, man, I could do this again and make it a better run. Because I actually used items in the other one. I was trying for a while. So I, I kind of got this fight down pretty good. We got the Dokkan attack. Oh, watch watch this. Right? They're already stunned. We're getting the Dokkan attack. Uh, it says we're doing 7 million right here. And if we crit, um, somebody could almost die. Yeah, you see, Beerus almost died with that first hit. Uh, the Dokkan attack, and now he's dead. And we stunned, so he can't do anything. Uh, and we get him down very low. So yeah, I'm off rotating the Tech Khalifa, uh, because they don't have the guaranteed chance of dodging. They dodge, it's based off Peppy Gals, and I think, uh, Universe 6, uh, category allies, like 6% each. So there's a good chance, but, uh, I tried it one time, and against Beerus, Beerus barely lived. Took out Khalifa, taking 356k per hit. So if you guys have any questions, uh, hey, put them in the comments down below. I'm making this a really short one. We use no items, 13 minutes. So this is uh, uh, from the first run that I had that I was going to, uh, you know, show the rewards and whatnot. You need both hits. And the friend system right now on Global is ass, so it could be hard. But anyway, best hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care. But first, hi there. If you liked what you saw, thank you.